Hello and welcome to Draft House Select. I'm Erica. And I'm Jenna. And this is a show with a little bit of game review and a little bit of playthrough. Today on tap we have Magic Maze. This game is designed by Casper Lapp by Dude Games for one to eight players. Takes about 15 minutes and for ages eight and up. Each player in the game has a direction that they can only move north, south, east, or west. Then you also have certain powers that each player can have to help you jump to certain parts of the board. And there are four different colors of the pieces and you can only move to a certain checkpoint before you can all start to exit the game. And everyone's in charge of every pawn out there. You don't have a specific color, like you're not purple, you're not yellow. Everyone moves it together. It's a very together-oriented game. Except for the fact that no one can speak to each other. So if you need to like point to someone to know that it is their turn, you have a big red pawn that's like three times the size of the other pawns. So if you know your teammate needs to move, but you can't tell them, you just kind of nudge them by placing that pawn. In front you just of them. slam it in front of them. It annoys a lot of people. Okay. And on top of everything, you're timed, so it adds a little bit of pressure to the situation. Yeah. If you have anxiety, don't play this game. <laughs> thing I do but you know <laughs> so overall I personally think this is a spirit to try and I think it's top show I enjoyed it but I kind of like the the element the extra challenges of it being a timed game so there's like it keeps it fun mm -hmm. and exciting and the fact that you can't talk to anybody because sometimes at game nights you just don't want to be around people <laughs> 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 then you play solitaire at home by yourself. Duh, Jenna. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, so I like to talk during games. I, not like a ton. She still found a way to talk during this I time. did. I talked to myself. So I don't know. I probably would have lost because of that. But I wasn't telling people what to do. So I was told I'm okay. Just talk yeah. to yourself, crazy lady. <laughs> um, so I did like the timed aspect because I do like things to move. Yeah. But when the red pawn's in front of you... And you're like, and you don't say, I'm like, I don't know what to do. I see that we have to go over here, but I don't like calling people out over here. And, uh, uh. So that's how I feel. That's been another episode of Draft House Select. I'm Jenna. And I'm Erica. Thank you for watching. <laughs>